from one of the greatest living directors comes one of the greatest MCU movies ever made. Yeah, that's right, the Mafia Cinematic Universe, huh? What do you think I'm talking about? Spider-Man over here? Come on, forget about it. Oh! Good fellas. Throw on a tank top, slip on a pinky ring, and crack open a carton of cigs, because you are about to enter the glamorous world of the Italian mob. It's got everything. Fast bread. Fast bread. I didn't have to wait in line at the bakery anymore. Cool nicknames. And there was Pete the Killer, Nicky Eyes, and Jimmy Two Times. I'm gonna go get the papers, get the papers. And a dozen of your best middle-aged guy friends for smooching on. <laughs> Hey, come here! Mwah. Yeah, mwah. yeah, you too! Mwah. Oh, yeah, it feels so good to be a gangster! Mwah. Mama Mia! Now smack me around a little! Oh! Enjoy a milestone in representation for sweaty guys who are ugly and sexy at the same time. Like Ray Liotta's Henry Hill, an outsider who provides the movie's voiceover. If we wanted something, we just took it. And it's laugh track. <laughs> You. <laughs> Just got money for that commercial, you know. Commercial, don't got my money. <laughs> it's funny because it's someone else's pain. Follow along on his Rico themed masterclass as he takes you from small time punk to professor of hoodonomics until he's brought down by a Joe Pesci sized mountain of cocaine. Oh well, at least he learned his lesson. Get to live the rest of my life like a schnook. At least he regrets his choices? It was a glorious time. At least he was slightly more willing to clean up other people's blood? That was the first time I'd ever seen anyone shot. Vito, Vito, get a towel! See? Good fella. But Henry's not the only mook in this mookie. Before he was the Irishman, Robert De Niro was this Irishman, Jimmy Conway. And before Scorsese could de-age that mug, they just said he was 28, and we all went with it. He couldn't have been more than 28 or 29 at the time. Then there's Joe Pesci's Tommy DeVito, who combines the body of Danny DeVito with the berserker rage of Wolverine. Make it happen, Feige. Lorraine Bracco shines as Karen Hill, whose Karen side only comes out when her husband's side chick is involved. Sister Superintendent, I want you to know, sir, that you have a living in the Otherwise, she's one of the all-time greats at ignoring crimes. I didn't think there was anything strange in any of this. What happened to your car? Oh, oh, you skunk, Karen, all right? Come on. None of it seemed like crimes. And supporting them all is a legendary cast of, hey, I know that guy's like that guy that guy and that guy if you're wondering where you know half the bad guys from it's the sopranos it's always the sopranos it happens strap in for a film packed with great characters incredible cinematography and more quotable lines for dads than a classic SNL box set. I'm funny how? I mean, funny like I'm a clown, I amuse you. To the point where you won't really care there isn't a plot. Just two and a half hours of crimes and vibes. But if you dig a little deeper, you find the story of a resilient kid who survives a tough New York childhood, only to take dangerous amounts of drugs, get a new suit, join a powerful organization, and do whatever it takes to protect the people he cares about the most. We're on our own. Forget everybody else. Because I'm with you to the end of the line. Oh, I could do this all day over here. Capiche? On my mother's grave. There right there is America's ass. So suit up for a film with more headshots than a Call of Duty deathmatch. Oh, no. And more slurs than, well, also that. Two just stole my truck. Like I'm a f here for f or something. You know who goes to jail? F stick up, man. That's who. That cheap cigarette hijacking. No. As this fast talking mobster draws the audience in, seducing you into his evil world until you realize, just like Henry, that you're trapped, paranoid, and f Six Ways from Sunday, in another Scorsese film that glorifies violence and toxic masculinity. As long as you ignore all the subtext, trust the unreliable narrator, and don't watch the last 40 minutes. But hey, there's plenty of entertainment out there for everyone. Perhaps you prefer something simpler, like a cartoon. What am I, a plate of dry steak butt meat here to amuse you? Starring B-Ray, Do Crime, Whack-A-Mole, 
Die Cousin Vinny, Broncos Modern Life, Boss Hog, Hell to Pay, Unhappy Feet, Two Coke Girls, Oh man, I shot stacks in the face, and the most f***s in a movie, until Scorsese beat his own record with Casino and Wolf of Wall Street. How the f*** am I funny? What the f*** is so funny about me? Get the f*** out of here, Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> I almost had him! I almost had him! White Menace to Society And it's kind of weird the same year this came out, they made another movie about the same mobster starring Steve Martin. Honestly, Goodfellas is a classic, but it's seriously lacking merengue. As far back as I could remember, I always wanted to be a gangster. Knuckles are red, Sonics are blue. I know the way, and you will know too. You spin me right round, baby, right round. 